You may be trying to download a file only to discover that Google Chrome says the file may be dangerous, so Chrome has blocked it. And the only option they seem to be giving you is to discard it. If you click on the little up arrow, you get learn more, but if you click on that, it just basically says Google Chrome blocks downloads, right? That's not very useful if you know that you need that file, if you know that you trust the source of that file, right? So what you need to do is go over here to where it says show all. Once you click on show all, you can actually choose to keep the dangerous file. Now note the name of the file here. It's NovaVench bracket one, right? This is actually a great uh, benchmarking utility I, from a site that I trust and I've used many, many times with no ill effect, right? So I'm gonna choose keep dangerous file, right? Then it gives you another warning. Hey, dude, even if you have downloaded files from this site before, the site may be temporarily unsafe, hacked. Try downloading this file later. I'm gonna say keep anyway, and I'm gonna show you how to make sure that it is safe. So let's say keep anyway. Now we can click on show in folder, right? Let's maximize that. And we can see if I click on the address bar here, I have the full path. I'm gonna actually copy that path because it's gonna come in useful in a moment. So there's our file, there's our path. Now let's minimize that. And this is how I'm gonna show you to check for uh, the safety of the file, just to make sure. I'm gonna click on a new tab here and go to virustotal.com, okay? Now you can click on choose a file and this is where that copied path comes in nicely. You can click in the address bar here, delete whatever's there and paste in the path. When you hit enter, you're now in the correct path. Double click on the file that you want to check and it will check with all of these antivirus. So I don't know the actual count these days, but uh, that looks to me like maybe 120 different antivirus uh, programs that have checked this software, this particular file, and not detected any file. So we got zero out of 61. Huh, I was way wrong. Okay, look twice as many to me. Zero out of 61 antivirus software says there's a virus, so you know you're good. Now you can confidently go, close your browser, right? Go back into your Explorer, and you can confidently run the file knowing that there's no virus in it and that you've gotten past the block that Google Chrome tried to put on it.